Back in the 60s, General Electric, together with the US Army, made something similar to an exoskeleton. The development called Hardy Man weighed almost 1,500 pounds and failed miserably in tests. However, exoskeletons in general are very promising, if only because they can help people with musculoskeletal disorders. The WHO estimates that there are about 1.7 billion of them. This is the area which the Dutch team Project March is working. This is the March 7. As you can guess, this is the seventh version. It was presented on March 11, 2022, and we'd like to highlight several features. Protection from water and splashes, which allows you to use it in bad weather. The ability to use it with regular shoes. A control system with a smartphone and state-of-the-art computer vision, which allows the system to determine a safe route on its own. Gardening enthusiasts will probably be interested in this system. This specialized robot with open-source code allows you to plant more than 30 different plants, both indoors and outdoors. Several versions are available, with a maximum working area of 7.8 by 20 feet. The price starts at $3,495. One of the key features of the system is its simplicity. Enthusiasts have already made apps that make farming look like a computer game. FarmBot takes only an hour to be installed, and it's easy to customize it for different tasks. For example, the rotary tool attachment is used for weed control. The working angle can be adjusted to plus or minus 70 degrees, and it can also be fitted with the included drill chuck, in which case it will also help you perform drilling operations. Here's another curious product. These soft grip systems are made of special threads with memory effect. Each finger of the design remembers its position. And if you inflate the built-in flexible cylinders, this unusual hand will firmly grasp a can, press a button, and perform other tasks. This solution is useful for several reasons at once. First, the huge library of materials allows you to customize a variety of behaviors. Secondly, the finished products are economical, simple, and don't require complex maintenance. And thirdly, the hands can be easily supplemented with various sensors, such as touch sensors. According to the US engineering team, it used to be expensive and time-consuming to make such systems. However, they have great potential, and thanks to advanced machine knitting technology, they've managed to take a huge step forward. When talking about robotics, we can't help but mention Japan. Today's selection features a snake robot created by a team from Kyoto University, one of the best educational institutions in the country. The purpose of this robot is to help in the case of natural disasters, for example, to search for victims. The project has been in development for quite a long time. Back in 2018, the snake with 36 joints was already able to move in confined spaces like tunnels and pipes. At the moment, the robot can jump climb a tree, ascend both the inside and the outside of a pipe, climb a ladder, and crawl through a debris-laden area. Control is facilitated by built-in cameras, and several snakes are capable of working together like a huge hand. Your Secret Gaming Room The creators of Dream Glass Flow entice potential backers, and the public loved these AR glasses so much that instead of the planned $10,000, they've already raised over $100,000, and the Indiegogo campaign is still not over. The main purpose of the device is entertainment. The glasses are compatible with both PlayStation and Xbox consoles, as well as PCs. In addition, you can connect them to portable consoles like the Nintendo Switch and the Steam Deck, getting the effect of playing on a huge screen. It weighs just two ounces, about the same as a Zippo lighter, and can be worn over regular glasses. Wi-Fi 6 and 5G are supported, and movie buffs will enjoy 3D technology, 
two speakers inside the temples, and a 3840 by 1080 resolution. The price starts at $379. Since we're talking about games, it's worth remembering the Assassin's Creed series. This game features battles between Templars and Assassins, as well as different eras, parkour, adventure, and a variety of exotic devices for eliminating the enemies and restoring historical justice. This craftsman assembled a hybrid between weapons from Assassin's Creed and World War II shooting gloves. The device is attached to the hand and shoots thanks to a carbon dioxide cartridge, which lasts for about 30 shots. The dart has no problem piercing a plastic bottle and plunging into a board. The files for those wishing to make their own copy have been posted on a forum. There are already potential buyers in the comments too. What do you think the price tag should be? By 2050, the urban population is expected to reach about 6.3 billion people. A decent portion of that number will be residents of coastal areas. In order to live more comfortably, they need at least minimal protection from potential problems. For example, these floating breakwaters. They are made to order by a Canadian company with a lot of parameters taken into account. The advantages of the solution include Cost effectiveness. If the depth at the installation site is more than 20 feet, conventional breakwaters are often more expensive. Practicality. Breakwaters don't interfere with fish migration and water circulation. And convenience. A floating version is ideal if the bottom relief is too specific. These breakwaters are made of large diameter steel pipes and fixed with concrete weights on the bottom of the body of water. Thanks to special epoxy resin treatment, they're aesthetically pleasing and long-lasting. Do you know how much money hay makes? Its global exports are estimated at two and a half or even three billion dollars per year. The main buyers are Arab countries, China and Japan, while the US led in sales in 2019 with 4.1 million tons. Not surprisingly, hay harvesting technology is becoming more and more advanced. This bale mover, for example, can work autonomously and pick up three bales at a time. The model is called the Bale Hawk and it's being developed by the American company Vermeer. The prototype was unveiled in 2021, and here's what we know about it. The bale width limit is about 5 feet. The bale mover can find its way around and can create a route on its own. Wireless sensors will send information about the state of the components. This information will help plan maintenance. And the 2021 version weighed about 6,614 pounds and was diesel powered. HP is much more than just printers and computers. They also make robots like this one. Here we see a layout printing robot that works 10 times faster than a human. HP reminds us that the construction sector generates $11.4 trillion. However, there are still not enough skilled specialists, so they have to make robotic assistance. HP Site Print fits into a briefcase, is tablet controlled, and is compatible with inks for a variety of surfaces. It prints directly from blueprints and architectural plans, and can do both simple lines and a variety of symbols. Preferably, there should be no obstacles on the floor, but if there are, the robot can bypass them and continue printing. The robot has already been tested on 80 different projects around the world, from parking lots to homes and hospitals. It's planned to go on sale on a large scale in 2023. This solution allows you to turn an ATV into an agricultural machine. It'll help you loosen the ground, level a gravel road, prepare a construction site, fight weeds, and in general, it'll turn an ordinary ATV into a universal agricultural soldier. Installing the system is a matter of minutes. Once upgraded, you can use your ATV in the same way, and it won't be a problem for you. 
The working width is 50 inches, the maximum ripping depth is about 2 inches, and the 0.19 inch high strength steel elements make the box blade one of the most durable solutions among competitors. However, you'll have to pay a pretty penny. The price is $759. The creators of this robot also found a way to the hearts of funders. The project has raised more than $2.5 million on Kickstarter, despite a starting price tag of $2,800. What are people willing to pay so much for, then? Let's see. The model is built on a tracked platform with interchangeable modules. Each module is responsible for a different task, which makes the robot very versatile. It can shovel snow. The width of the cleared lane is 21 inches, and the height of the snow intake is up to 18 inches. Mow lawns. The width of the strip is 20 inches, and the trim height is adjustable from 1.2 to 4 inches. And blow away leaves and debris. Airflow reaches 119 miles per hour, like a tropical storm. The robot makes ground maintenance much easier and works even at minus 22 degrees Fahrenheit. It can be controlled via a controller or an app, and its 38.4 amp hour battery is also useful as a backup power source. Next is the best invention of 2007, according to Time magazine. The Boeing X-48 is an experimental American drone. Based on the blended wing body, a type of flying wing, engineers believe that a 480-seat passenger version could be about 32% more fuel efficient than the Airbus A380-700. However, there is a problem. The Boeing X-48 is quite difficult to operate. There are several different models known. The X-48B, for example, has a cruising speed of 124 miles per hour and a 21-foot wingspan. The latest news about the project was posted on Boeing's website in 2016. The company said that it's working with NASA and sees the potential to develop similar aircraft in the next 10 years as a subsonic vehicle for military and commercial transport. 